Welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install and configure CyberLab Mega Bezel Death to Pixels Shader Preset Pack by CyberLab, and it's designed to be used with Mega Bezel. In order to use these presets, you need to make sure you have Mega Bezel configured. I've created a short tutorial video on how to do so, and I'll leave that linked in the description below. Once you've configured Mega Bezel, you need to go to the CyberLab homepage, which is also linked in the description below. Once you're there, you'll land on this page and then you need to scroll part way down the page until you get to this link here where it says CyberLab Mega Bezel Death to Pixels Shader Preset Pack. So let's open this link in a separate tab and then you'll land on this page. Here is the link to the preset pack so if we click this to download. Once that's downloaded go back to the previous page and then scroll down a little further and you'll see this link here, CyberLab Custom Blog NTSC Video Filter Presets and click this and click this link here to download. And once you have both of those downloads completed, you need to extract them into their own folders. Now on screen, I have two folders open. On the left-hand side are my downloaded CyberLab files, and on the right-hand side is the location where I have RetroArch installed. So firstly, open the CyberLab custom blog NTSC video filter preset, and then open the RetroArch folder, and then move the filters folder over to the RetroArch root directory, like this and then go back to the main CyberLab folder. Next, go to the CyberLab Mega Bezel Death to Pixels preset folder, and then you'll see a folder called CyberLab. Now on the RetroArch installation folder, you need to go to the shaders location. And open it. And then you need to make sure you've made a folder called mega underscore bezel underscore packs, like this one here and then open it, and then move the CyberLab folder here, like this. And there we go, you're done! Now open RetroArch. Once you've loaded a game, you'll notice the image is a little stretched. But not to worry, if you press F1 to go to the Quick Menu, and then go all the way down to Shaders, and then go to Load, and then Mega Bezel Packs, and CyberLab. And here you'll see all of CyberLab's shader presets divided up into subfolders. So for this video, I'm just going to use the very first folder. And here you're able to choose the resolution of your display. And then you'll find a ton of shader presets. Anything with a dot slang P at the end of it is a shader preset. For this demo, I'm going to try CyberLab Blending and Transparency PVM Edition. And press Enter to load and press F1 to go back to the game. And thanks to the power of Mega Bezel, the aspect ratio has now been fixed. And you also get the cool reflections on the bezel. And a wonderful shader preset by CyberLab has now been applied. I hope this video was useful and I hope you have fun trying out all of CyberLab's shader presets.